Hi guys and welcome to the gone to series. In the earlier tutorials we talked about on how to make a function in RESTful web service accepts multiple parameters sent by the client in the HTTP URL as the path parameters. In this tutorial we are going to talk about on how RESTful web service accepts multiple parameters sent by the client in the HTTP URL as the query parameters or a query string. Before we go to this demo let us see what do we mean by a query parameter in the HTTP URL? If a client mentions the parameters in the HTTP URL in the format of a query string, then the parameters listed in the URL are known as the query parameters. For example, in this URL, the client has passed two parameters, 23 and 45. If the parameters are passed in the URL and are listed in this particular fashion, that is, all parameters appear in the end after question mark symbol and one parameter is separated from other using the ampersand symbol. Then those parameters are known as the query parameters. Alright, let's go to this demo for clear understanding. The client would call a get function, get students info residing in the university restful web service using this HTTP URL. These are the roll numbers of the students which client would pass to the RESTful web services function as a query parameters or a query string. And then the RESTful web service would receive these parameters and map them to its functions parameters and send the same roll numbers of the students back to the client as a response. Let's start. This is the demo we saw in last tutorial about how to accept multiple path parameters from a HTTP URL sent by the client using path param annotation. I would delete off this existing function and would create the new one for this demo. Just to save some time, I already have written the function. Let us go through it fully. The client would access this function using this URL. This function would extract these query parameters using query param annotation and map them to the strings student roll number 1 and student roll number 2. The query param annotation binds the value of a HTTP query parameter to a resource method parameter. So function is ready. Let's run it on the server and test this. Paste the URL in your browser and press enter. Yes, the RESTful web service has accepted the multiple parameters sent by the client in the HTTP URL as a query parameters. In the next tutorial, we'll talk about on how a RESTful web service accepts multiple parameters sent by the client in the HTTP URL as a matrix parameter. Mm -hmm.